You just got your orders to a new duty station and you think you're ready to go, but there are a few things you need to know before you get on the road during the peak PCS season, which is May 15th through August 31st. Whether it's just you, you and a partner, or your whole family, you probably have a lot of stuff. And proper planning is essential for a smooth relocation. Early planning is the key. Visit move.mil to start planning your move. There, you'll request access for the Defense Personal Property System, also known as DPS. DPS is accessible 24-7, 365. At move.mil, you'll either submit a self-counseling application into DPS, or you'll be instructed to visit a counseling office to help with your move. Visit move.mil for specific guidance based on your situation. Just remember, either way, you need to bring your orders to the counseling office for your counseling appointment or upload them into DPS to complete your submission of an application. So what's next? A Transportation Service Provider, or TSP, will contact you to assess your move's needs. They'll conduct a pre-move survey no less than 72 hours before your move. They may ask you to send a video of your belongings in place of a survey, but that's optional. It's up to you. When it's time to decide on a pickup date, you'll negotiate with the TSP based on your needs. But remember, availability may be limited during the busy PCS season, May 15th to August 31st. Finally, during your pickup, your TSP may capture your inventory electronically. If they do, they must give you a hard copy of the report if you request one. You can request a reway in DPS or with your transportation provider or transportation office if you believe you are near your weight entitlement. Are you shipping your stuff and your car? Be sure to visit PCSMyPOV.com. You'll get all the details there, but some key points. Contact your personal property office with any questions. Complete any safety recalls that are associated with your car. And when dropping off your car, bring all of the required documentation. Also, after drop off, be sure to complete a customer comment card. So you planned your move, and now it's time to start the pack and pickup. Here's some key tips. Pack dates are usually one to two days before the actual pickup date of your shipment. All of your things that should not be packed should be placed in a separate location in your house and identified to packing crews. While the TSP will contact you initially when your shipment is surveyed, the actual pickup will likely be done by a local agent. Pickup will be scheduled to happen between 08 and 1700 hours. If any issues or questions arise during pickup, make sure to contact your installation, transportation, or traffic management office for assistance. Now you're on your way to your new duty station, and everything is about to land at your new place. What do you do? First, it's critical that you maintain a good email address and phone number in DPS so that you can be reached while you're moving just in case the TSP needs to contact you. So, what are the TSP's responsibilities? Well, they'll deliver your stuff between 08 and 1700, unpack and unwrap all of your things, provide a one-time placement of boxes and appliances where you want them, assemble furniture if they disassembled it, and clear all debris when the move is done. Never sign a blank, incomplete, or illegible form, and don't argue with your TSP. Contact your transportation office immediately if there are any problems. From planning, to packing, to transport, to unpacking, it's possible you'll hit a snag. At any time during the process, you can contact your nearest transportation office to answer any questions using the locator information on move.mil. Was something lost or broken during your move? Go to DPS, where you can file a loss or damage report within 75 days of delivery and find more detailed information on how to move forward with your actual damage claim. If you experience loss or damage to your POV, coordinate the claim settlement through the Destination Vehicle Processing Center. If you have additional questions for either household goods or POV claims, contact your local legal or military claims office. Thanks for your time. And remember, 
Move.mil is your one-stop information portal for your PCS move. Good luck and safe travels.